Space Station Zero. Hello everybody and welcome to Space Station Zero. Today we are reacting to Wrath of Man. It says it's the Red Band trailer. Uh, I'm not sure if it's going to be very much different from the other trailer that we did. Of course from the thumbnail here you can see there's plenty of blood all over him. And I think that that and maybe some curse words might be the difference. But we're going to find out. It could be more information on here than we got before. It's already on my list. It looks like a really good movie already. But I wanted to check out this Red Band trailer and just see what the difference is. I do pausing. If you don't like that type of thing, always leave the link down in the description below. Although, since we've already kind of seen the other version of this, I don't know how much pausing I'm going to do first go around. With all that said, let's check it out. It's his son. His only son. I need to know who's responsible. I'll kill my son. We've deployed large amounts of time, money, and effort in the search for justice. Not good enough. It's got to be an inside job. You're going to have to go undercover, boss. There's an armored truck driver. We have a new addition. May I introduce H? Cash trucks can be dangerous. I've got your fucking friend. They're serious. Leave this to me. Throw the money in the flatbed. Just do what he says. Who is this fucking lunatic? Who did you work for? Suck my fucking dick. What did you say? I said... We need a different approach, boss. It's not any of the usual suspects. What do you want me to do? I can do it in two weeks. What do you want to wish you could do it in 20 years? Give me a name. I need a face. I need to understand. I'm resourceful. That's serious, I am. And I do bear a grudge. If he's not a cop, what is he? He's a dark fucking spirit. <laughs> Okay, so, yeah, uh, yeah, that trailer was a lot better, um, I had mentioned that before, let me get past the red bit here, um, pause, I have mentioned that before in the other reaction is that it seemed like it was all mixed up and I was having to try to figure out the story from the trailer, but this one here, it kind of matches what I thought you know you could tell in this one here that the thing happened to his kid but that one guy is like what do you expect to do about it boss so I don't know if he's also in some type of organized crime maybe or something or if he's just I don't know sure what his occupation is when he goes in undercover sort of as a uh, armored truck driver let me just go through it and pick out all the things that I noticed it's his son his only son yeah, they started off with the oh shot right in the face. I didn't see that the first time. Good pause. Uh, <laughs> so they start. They they mentioned the sun bit like later on, several scenes later. So it was like kind of flashbacky. But here, you know, they've mentioned it, you know, straight away. Yeah, and here you get to see the actual shots. I think the first one you just seen him fall. Large amounts of time. I thought that was George Clooney at first. Uh, <laughs> when he's standing there and he's talking to whomever he is in this office, it's really nice. He got fancy clothes on. They apparently know each other. I mean, he's just going in and saying he's gonna, you know, wants to take care of it himself because it was obviously his son. So maybe he is in the same crime family, and this makes him break away from it when the boss doesn't do what he wants or something like that. You're gonna have to go undercover, boss. There's an armored truck driver. 
you're gonna have to go undercover boss but they sound like they dubbed that boss part back in let's listen to that an inside job you're gonna have to go undercover boss there's an yeah. truck driver right so this part here you know the voice telling him what to do over the radios wasn't in the first one what did you say i said right so i think this is some sort of edit uh like i said before i was like man they, they killed him straight away you know post malone's in here he's got to have more information than just guy in truck with no mask running gets shot uh, there's, there's got to be more than that so i'm pretty sure he gets information from him after some short bit of torture and uh you know and then, then goes ahead and kills him you know whatever So those dudes were tied up. I didn't notice that before either. When he comes through, it made it look like he was just exiting the boss's office on the other trailer. But this here looks like um, his guys were already there and tied up these other guys. Doing 20 years. Like this is one of his guys. There's another one of his guys following him. But when these guys fall, it seems like their hands are bound together. Yeah. Right there, his hands are behind him and this guy, and then there's another one that he takes care of. I'm gonna give me a knife. I'm not do bear a grudge. Oh, and this part right here. Just pay attention to this part right here. I'm gonna go back just a little bit. He was dumping on him last time, but this part here, I guarantee you he shoots more bullets than are in that clip. <laughs> if he's not a cop, what is he? He's a dark fucking spirit. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, better trailer. Better trailer for sure. And not only because of the blood and the cussing, it's just better put together than the first trailer. You know, you can follow the sequence of events and you can really, you know, pick out what's going on. If you didn't see the first trailer and just seen this trailer, you would be in a good in a good place, you know. But if you've seen the first trailer, you may not want to see the second trailer. It wasn't put together in a manner to where you could really pick out what was going to be happening in the story or what you were going to be getting yourself into. Um, you basically just knew that you're getting into an action movie and there you go. Hey, it's an action movie. He kills a lot of people. And then later on you find out about his son and something about the crime family. It just kind of was all just hodgepodge together. You could decipher it, but you just couldn't decipher it easily. I don't know. Maybe they like putting out puzzle trailers. You know, I like to do puzzles, so. <laughs> like, share, subscribe. Let me know what you thought down in the comments below. Let me know if I missed anything. I'm pretty sure I did. I always do. And then uh, make your suggestions on other things you want me to react to. And uh, see me later.